Okay, so let's actually use one of the photo gates right now to do a practice calculation. You know, when we collect data for the lab, we're not going to want to have to do the calculations manually every single time, but it's important to understand how do we make the calculation with this before we tell the machines to start doing the work for us. So I've actually made a few, uh, actually made two measurements of the speed. I'm going to show you those two measurements. So remember, B0 is going to be this guy over here, and then over on the other side is going to be the final velocity. So I'm going to go ahead and write these two in to my given information, and then let's go ahead and get everything all set up for you, and let's see you calculate what was the acceleration of this in meters per second squared. All right, so I'm going to put the numbers up here. Our initial velocity is 0 0.31 meters per second. Final velocity, 0 0.46 meters per second. And as we've already stated, the distance is 0 0.059. meters. So all you need to do is to plug these numbers into this formula and calculate the acceleration. And once you do that, then we'll let the computer do the rest of the work in the Photogate lab. Good luck on the Photogate lab, guys.